Amid the beautiful nature of the Philippines, a green revolution is being formed from seemingly worthless things, pineapple leaves. Today, we will explore the inspiring story of Pinatex, an eco-friendly material that is transforming the fashion industry. And this story begins with a remarkable woman, Dr. Carmen Hijosa. During a visit to Manila, Dr. Carmen Hijosa realized two major issues in the leather industry, poor quality and negative environmental impact. The animal tanning process requires the use of toxic chemicals such as formaldehyde and heavy metals like chromium, which pollute the environment and affect the health of local people. This motivated her to seek a more sustainable alternative material. By chance, she discovered that the traditional Barong Tagalog shirts of the Philippines are made from piña, a fabric made from pineapple leaf fibers. The cellulose fibers from pineapple leaves are surprisingly strong and smooth. She collaborated with local weavers to develop a non-woven fabric from pineapple leaf fibers. After five years of research, Pinatex was born, initiating a revolution in the fashion industry. With the cradle-to-cradle -cradle philosophy, the Pinatex production process is designed to be as environmentally friendly as possible. Pineapple leaves are collected, stripped of fibers, washed, dried, and the chlorophyll and plant resin are removed. Pinatex is created from agricultural waste, requiring no additional land, water, pesticides, or fertilizers, thus minimizing environmental impact. The remaining biomass after fiber extraction can be used as fertilizer, providing additional income for farmers. Pinatex can be dyed, printed, and treated to create various textures and thicknesses, making it a perfect substitute for leather in products such as shoes, handbags, and sofas. Pinatex is clear proof that fashion and sustainability can go hand in hand. We hope this story inspires you. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel to stay updated with more interesting information. Thank you for watching.